Joe Graham, The Great Wheel of Winter. Rituals to Thrive in the Dark Circle of the Cyclum. So, obviously I haven't read her other book where she, like, goes through the whole cycle in itself. But this is um, about the final cycle of endings before the time of renewal and rebirth. Hands-on exercises and rituals. Um, building on the foundation that was established in The Great Wheel. This book reveals how the energy of this era influences your spiritual path, relationships, and community. Um, exploring the powerful cycle of generations, lifespans, and season. Winter offers uh, specific techniques and supports to help you see that the era of winter is only temporary and spring will soon come again. So this isn't about the season winter, but um, the season of winter, like, lifespan, certain years, um, certain, like, generations, because, like, um, because at the time of reading, I think, at the time, I think at the, like, the time of writing, and, like, I think right now, we're in a winter, um, so, like, you get, like, this chart, um, so, like, your generation and, like, youth, adulthood, maturity, old age. So, like, if you're spring-born, youth would be spring, adult would, would be summer, maturity would be autumn, and old age would be winter. If you're an autumn-born, your youth would be autumn, adult, winter, maturity, spring, old age, summer. And then, um, so, baby, baby boomers, um, spring born, gen X, um, summer born, millennials, hello, um, they will have come of age with the, the youngest 19, oldest 39, um, and autumn born. So, millennials were autumn born. Um, they have always known a darkening world. Um, and Homelanders, 20, 2002, or since, they're born in the winter. Uh, winter and our children and teenagers. So... You got, like, this wheel thing, so, so, like, um, winter solstice 2010, spring, e um, Invoc 2020, spring equinox 1950, so, and, like, winter is here, and you got, like, crisis area, era, um, And you get like this like chart type of thing. So date, octave, national mood, elders, maturity, youth, um, childhood. So like 2020, Imbolc, national mood, grim, elders, silent, and baby boom. Maturity, generation, generation X, youth, um, millennials, childhood, homelanders. Or say 2000, Samhain, Divided and Darkening, um, Elders, Greatest and Silent, Maturity, Baby Boom, Youth is Generation X, and Childhood was Millennials. Uh. Um. So, Stories as Messages. Roman Palentia, a modern Palentia rite. So you get that. Um, and, it, and she goes through a few different um, winter cycles. So like um, the last, so last winter broadening the picture. Um, let's review how last winter played out. Our last winter had three phases that we will look 
look at it in um, greater depth. The cold arrives circa 1925 to 1932, days without sun, 33 to 41, and the blizzard, 42 to 45. So, as a whole, 20, 1925 to 45 was um, last winter, and she goes... Um, goes into that um Samhain, first of all 2000 is not the present um there was just massive culture changes between 1920 and 40 so there are massive culture changes between 2000 and 2020 like no smartphones no facebook no twitter yet um top movies were axman and hidden dragon top tv shows csi dora the explorer and survivor um, values, Gathering Storm, um, Athena Strato, strategic, strategic Planning, um, Clearing Discord, Going Into the Iliad, um, Banishing Discordia, um, Going through like different um, events throughout history, um, she gives you this warding the home um, ritual to do if you want. Um, Mercury, Apollo, so. Um, so yeah, we are in the winter sometime around 2025, and the pattern of the cyclical holds true. We will come to the end of the psych crisis era, to this point when we say to ourselves, both as individuals and people, okay, what happens next? An era has ended, it's time for a new one to begin. It may be hard to move on from winter, to, no matter how challenging it has been. This meditation is designed you to leave winter so that you may begin in the next season. And so you get a meditation. And so it's just a book about how to deal and working with the winter season. Um, ob like obviously like these cycles last a number of years. So like if you get this book before 2025, <laughs> um, um, it can be a good use for you or like a great, um, I'm pretty sure she'll make individuals, uh, individual books about the other seasons as well, I'm pretty sure. Um, like have them as a collection with her Great Wheel book. Um, or if you want to come back to these, um, ex like rituals or exercises, um, But, um, I'm not huge on this, um, obviously I'll, like, I do have a copy of The Great Wheel, I'll have to go through that first and see if this makes any more sense, so, so that's likely the thing is read that first and then read the individual seasons because like I'm under the assumption she's going to do other ones the, the other seasons but yeah um if it does have an interest to you this can be a decent book to have a look at but yeah the great wheel winter happy readings